Good morning everybody, it's Vapix here from Subjugated Gaming, bringing you some more Horus Heresy Legion's King of the Hill. This is Season 5, Episode 13. Now last time we were on NASA and we were doing alright. And to be honest, I played with a little... I played with him a little bit outside of this between the last two episodes. And he's actually not too bad. I've had some cool games where I've pulled out bullshit wins against some aggro decks. So, like, he's not too bad. You know, I'm 9 for 12. So, it's not, not terrible at this point, you know? That's not horrible at all. That's 75% win rate, which is kind of what you want. So, we're going to get into it and see how we go with the rest of the thing. I hope we go well because I've been enjoying playing him. He's actually pretty skill intensive with being able to hide yourself and stuff like that all the time. So, I'm keen to keep it going. What do we got? Conrad Curse. Okay, this was hard. This was one of my only losses, actually. It was against the Conrad's Curse deck. So, I think we can get rid of these two for now. Okay. Um, we're going to start with supplies. Going first is feels good. That's the best one we could have got, actually. We can go aggro now. We chuck this down. Just don't play Recon Claw. And we're feeling much better. Okay, supplies. We can deal with supplies turn one. Okay, that was, that was decent for him to get. He's lost the energy there. So for anyone who hasn't seen it yet, I'm hoping by the time this video comes out, the first episode of Lit Lovers will be up. Go watch that, please, because it's my girlfriend and I playing games together and getting drunk. The first episode, we don't get drunk, but the second episode, we most surely do. So there's that. It was really good. Um, so here we're actually going to do this. We're going to get all that damage in so early on. So that feels good. Because um, that was they were really fun to make. The sound's a bit weird because we're using one mic. We have to stay, both of us have to stay near it and stuff like that. But um, we're getting better at it. So I hope you guys um, watch that because it's a lot of fun. Man, he took so much damage off that one dude. And he's already down to 18. That feels really good. Oh, spear. Perfect. Okay. We might be able to pull this one out by just being super fast. Where are you at? You're at 4k. So he's above us, which is good. That's fine, it'll die. Um, to be honest, it's gonna die like this. Um, and then we're just gonna do this, and then we'll play Blood Games. Well, we got it at least, so that's nice. If we can kill him before Madness, that's gonna be ideal. We need like a Godstone or something. Oh, he's just gonna leave. Okay, we'll take the first win. Easy peasy. Nice, okay. We got bots off, right, just in case? Yeah, bots are off, good. Okay, still going. All right, next up, we got... Oh, Tark, what? It's been a quick minute since I've seen anyone play this guy. Oh, of course it's Vats a fan. Of course it is. Um, those can all go. We'll keep the girls done and keep the blood games. Gotta be aggro. Okay, actually, we've got the hunters, so that's good. And the band supplies. We're feeling good with this hand. I'm ready for this. He'll shoot us for one. It's if it dies, draw a card, yeah. Let us do battle. Bass of Fan's always playing weird and interesting decks, and I actually love it. So we got to remember, he's Sons of Horror, so he does have a lot of damage output. So we have to be careful. Like, in terms of face damage. So we can't forget that he's got, like, uh, Ventral Spirit and stuff. So... Ah. Um, How do I want to play this? I think I just... Blood games. Decent. And then... We're going to swing here. That way next turn if he swings at us, we can just get get it off field and whatever. Oh, neat. So... Are you... Wait... What? Why are you neat? Oh, okay. Well, we're okay with that if we're honest. Can you shoot your own stuff? Yeah, you can. Um, So here we'll just... Get rid of this. We're okay with that. Get a little bit of heals, and we can just have to protect ourselves a lot. Because if we go below a certain amount of life, we'll struggle. And we're okay with that. Because all we do is that. And then I'm pretty sure I want to do that. Which is fine. He can trade out. We'll just go invisible. And now we just got to save up cards to punch him down. Basically. 
Yeah, that's fine. Sure. We're okay with that. Uh, so, yeah, we're gonna just do this. Go invisible. The Survivor 5 was very helpful. Not to mention we can heal 4 here. Yep, and then shoot it for 1. Sure thing. We're gonna play this. And swing at that. And he'll probably have the, um... Outflank, but... If he's got the outflank, he's got the outflank, you know. We have to eat them. At least, if we're eating it off this, we're not eating it on our hunting eagles, at least. Maybe he hasn't got it. If he doesn't have it, that feels very good. It looks like he doesn't have it. Interesting. Is he just gonna, gonna go face here? Looks like he's gonna go face. Okay. Yep. This is fine. Like, we know he's got heals and stuff in his hand now. We'll go invisible. We'll give the buff. We'll smack for 10. Um, we'll goldstone and we'll unturn. And we're sitting okay. Did you draw the outflank? No. What are you stunning? That makes sense. Sure thing, we can swing this into it, get, um... Precog off it. Swing here. The thing is, right, while we're not drawing cards, it's fine, because we've got this. And then hopefully we can get the refill energy card off it that we play as well. We'll see how we go. Chop, sure, you can draw. We're okay with that. Yep. And play the other one. Yep. Secret so 5. Let's see what we go. Okay. So we definitely want to do this. Okay, and then we're going to do this. Decent. And then do we want to refill our energy this turn, or do we want to wait? Because we definitely want to do that. I don't think we're going to refill our energy this turn. And then we can do this, and then turn. I'm surprised he hasn't got his outflank yet. He's been digging. Like, if he's only playing one, then there's a chance that he hasn't got it. So that's fine. The fact we hit Survivor again feels good. We still got 18 life plus the 4 here. Like, we're feeling not bad. There's the Vengeful Spirit. Seems like he had nothing else to do. Okay. That's fair. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Can hit him for 11 this turn, but I don't think it's worth it. So we're going to do that. We're going to do that. We're going to play this. We're going to end turn. One of these needs to five for our next turn for us to win. He's got a goldstone, so he can probably get rid of this one. Sure. You've already used one of your four damage ones, so you haven't got both. Use your goldstone. No heals, sure. And now use your gold zone. Okay, we're okay here. So we punch you for six. Um, we can then... Kill that. Do that. Yeah. Get that off board. Fill our energy. Do this. 
shoot you, and then we'll wait. Just in case any buckery happens. We have no idea of the identity of any card in hand, other than probably an outflank. If he's not playing outflank, that's pretty ballsy. And he might not be, apparently. Sure, where's that going? Well, you haven't got enough damage to kill face, do you? No way you've got another 8 damage of 6 energy. There's nothing that does that. Double quick fire would get you close, but you don't have it. I guess he was drawing to see what he had, but I think the answer is not much. Yeah, well, that's game. GG, alrighty. Nice. Third game of the day, let's keep going. If we can win five straight with this guy, that'll be amazing. Ooh, Alpha Legion, this could be interesting. This could be very interesting. Um, okay... I think we get rid of that and do this. This could be our loss here. It should be very interesting. Um, so I think we're okay with just shooting him at the beginning. Then turn two using void engagement and ability. Turn three using blood games and ability. Okay, so he's Alpharius. This is about victory. True victory. Okay, you can have one of those. Interesting. Shoot, void engagement. Decent. We're actually going to probably use that instead of blood games next turn. Okay, yep. We're actually going to have to do this this turn. Which is fine. To be honest, on our turn, jumping this guy is going to be good. He can stun him, but we've got draw. Yep. What are you playing, then? One of many. Okay, going to heal up this early. Interesting. We're okay with that, I think. Because we will just land this guy, swing here, and turn. Because we have our hunting eagle to smack into it if we need to. But to be honest, just trading, shooting, playing other stuff is probably a good idea. Stunning it? Sure, you can stun that. Ooh, Petch. Well, your stuff doesn't work against me, at least. Alright, so this turn, we're going to abandon supplies. See what we get. That's decent for next turn. And we're going to run here. Do this, so you can't just as easily get rid of that. You have to do something else for it. Yep, that makes sense. Whoa, you can do that on that guy's now? I didn't think you could with the secret orders. I didn't think you could. Interesting. Well, we're going to do that. Actually, we're just going to swing at it. So I'm going to play this one now and then blood games. Ah, okay. What's that doing? Deal three damage and stun. Sure, we're okay with that. What are you doing then? Sure, drawing. Heaps of card in Oh wow, this is gonna be tight if we can get like a goldstone. Oh, that's that's your stretching. Oof. Yeah, well, we're not gonna draw now, are we? But I think I'm gonna make us draw. Like we're just gonna take the draw damage. And get him low. We're like, we're gonna take these points of damage, I think. Which is fine by us, because we got so much damage in that turn. If we need to, we'll use Laz Rifle to shoot this on our turn. But dropping this might be good too. Sure, that makes sense, that's fine. 
So far we're swinging here, swinging here, dropping this. Where's that going? There? That's fine. Mm, that's a little annoying. Oh, we didn't draw though, so it's fine, eh? Uh, we're gonna put this one here. Oh, we're fine with that. Yeah, take the five damage. Just gets rid of the shield. Perfect. Gotta keep a hand low because of um, the board wipe. I think this is actually a bad matchup for us with all the stun that comes around. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Essentially, we should be running some sort of anti-stun, but I just don't for some reason. I don't think there's enough of it around to really warrant it. Mm -hmm. we'll take the two. And we'll go to five. Sure. That'll go up by one. Yep, cool. Yeah. Now what you doing? Because your board wipe does not get you out of this. Over here? Oh, there. Okay, sure. Then you swing here. And what have you got for three damage? A goldstone? No. For the Emperor. Stun me. We won't draw. Smack. Goldstone. Now you can copy this thing. Which would be an issue, actually. And there's not much we can do about it. Oh, you can't copy and play it in the same turn, though. So we have at least one more turn. Unless you can stun this, we're feeling good. Okay, we're going to still swing face with that. I think he might be trying to bait us. Because we can still win. Oh, okay, there's a stun. That's annoying. And we're not going to draw, so our turn is just end turn because he got that last double stun. Now he gets to play this. And do nothing else, basically, if he chooses to play it. Hopefully, if he does choose to play it, he swings this and takes a 7 because then we win. Swing at it. Go on, sw damn it. Okay. So here... How do we play this? We shoot it, double swing at it, play this to swing at it. So we do that right. And then... And it still survives. That's probably the best way. So we still have a hunting eagle. Like, what's his end game at this point? Just my cards? Okay, that's fine. Because we get to draw now, at least. Oh, of course he's got the heal. At least he can't steal my cards anymore. What do we draw? Not the best for this turn. We're actually just going to take the damage. We need to bait out more before we play our cards. Like, this is only shit all damage. See, that's what we needed to bait out, something like that. Not that we can get rid of that. No, oh, okay. Well, you can stun our troops now. Ow. Yeah. Hmm. 
That's a bit annoying. Okay, so... He's got six damage here. He's got to find four. Three, actually, because this all draws and deals one. He's got the nine drop. He would, right? Nope. We're okay with that. That actually helps us. He's just got to find one more damage. And he wins. That doesn't do it. Okay. Oh. Thank you very much. For drawing me to the win. Wow. Okay. We got it. We got lucky out of that one, I think. He was relying on his draws, figuring that we could kill him on our turn easily. But he drew us into the win. Thanks very much. Appreciate it. Three in a row. Alright, what do we got? Oh, okay, here we go. This will be a good test. If we can win this one, this will be a great test. We get to go first here, so that's good. Um, we can throw all of this. Not a good opening hand. Like, we, all that stuff is good, but it's not good for us right now. We need stuff to be able to get stealth. No, not stealth. Precognition. If we can chain precognition against this guy, we'll be feeling very, very good. The problem is he's got a lot of burst damage. So we definitely need to draw our precognition cards for those turns where he's ready to do it. Okay, this is good. So we shoot you and turn. Yes, you are. Okay, let's see if we can't get this. Okay, bridge. Sure, so he's already setting up for the win. Hey, you did. So this guy's like top of the food chain right now. That's the draw card. That's good. Can we do this? Thank you. I still want to be able to right-click you and then left-click you just to do the ability. Like, please. Please. Okay, that's a bit annoying. Not much we can do about that. Um, this just has stealth. Rally gains stealth, so we can't even get around it. We're just going to end up taking that damage. Um... Do we want to play this card? Just to have something on the field? I don't know. I think we just do this and then turn. I think that's all we can do. Take the four and then get precog off it. Like, we could have played pre-natural skills there and hoped we drew the five drop. That could have board wiped. But I don't think it was worth it. Mm -hmm. What are you giving it? Survivor 2. That's fine. Oh, you're just going to leave it there? Okay, interesting. Well, let's do this. And then let's do this and this. Hmm. I mean, we're not going terribly here, but we're not doing great. That thing in stealth is really annoying me. Yeah, that's fine. We can get stealth a lot off that stuff. Not now, but you know. That's fine. Okay. We're gonna fill you with bot flies, I think. So have two more. Get rid of that. And now all we need to do is be able to find one damage every turn and we'll have bot flies forever to be able to gain precognition. Mm hmm. Sure thing. So how do we get it this time? Three, four, five. What is that? That's draw. To be honest, what we're doing is this. And we're going to smack that one. This is now all the time we can be able to get stealth everywhere. What does this guy do? Mutations? Give one, yeah, friendly demon. Okay. But we can board wipe easily at high energy. Okay, that doesn't mean anything.
Sure, that doesn't mean anything. And this is how we win. Until we can combo you down a bunch. And there's nothing you can do about it. Perfect! Unless I fuck up, I win. Don't care. Don't care. So two, that's six, seven, eight. So we can't do heaps this turn. So we need to activate this. And then what we're gonna do is smack here, get precog, smack you, you can have more bot flies. And that's fine. Because we've got 10 damage with this, right? From face. And this is 6 damage. So next time we do that, for 6, and with our other 4, we get stealth off something, hopefully. Buff its defense? No. Got ward, we don't care. Ward? Yeah, sure. Okay. Oh, that was good. Let me think then. We win, don't we? 15? Yeah. Nice. Alright. Good game. Good game. That Warlord, by the way, is top dog because he's very, very strong right now. And we cruised him because we played well. I think I actually might main this guy at the moment instead of Mortarian because being able to get precognition is so, so, so strong. Like, it's not just you stun one thing, it's nothing can attack you. Okay, well, here's the mirror. If we lose this, I'm okay with it. Uh, okay. Actually, we can keep this and throw that one. We're going first here. I've lost a mirror before. That was one of my losses. It was a loss to a mirror. Okay, this is decent. This is very decent. Let's do that. Okay, into that. Into a miss. Sure thing. Not a great opening without luck there, but that's okay. Yeah, that makes sense. Oh, that's good. So now time we are just could probably play this and swing at him, because you need to be fast. A lot of people are playing supply lines to get out their vehicles early. So that's a thing we need to watch out for. Actually, we're going to do this. Oh, okay, we're going to do it twice. Decent. There we go. Thank you. Oh, that's a good card to get. Ooh, ouch. Okay. How do we deal with this? We might just ignore it for a turn. Right? Is that what we do? And then kill it with this and this on our next turn? I think that might be the go. Because this is strong if we can get like a godstone. And then swing here. Yeah. We might actually take the two damage of this as a full health. Yeah. Absolutely what we're going to do. Okay, this is nice combo too. We just got to make sure we get a gold stone soon. And that would feel good. Okay, yeah. I guess that was going to happen. You gotta use preacher natural skills here. Oh, no, we don't. But I think we will. So he doesn't draw. And then we'll do it there. Ouch. Mm. 
Let me do that. And you swing here. Oh, that's really not good. Um, that's really, really not good. Maybe we should play that. How do we get out of this? Well, we play this. And then... We shoot that. We might just lose this mirror here because of that card. Oof. Oh, wow. Big ouch. Um... Um, three. Ugh. We can't. No attack. Because this kills those, and we don't want that to happen. So we got to try and get it off this. And in order to do that, that's three, four, five, six. And that's seven, right? So we, we could kill this, but it doesn't save us. Um. Wait, or does it? Hmm, hang on. Because we can do this, so we can spend six. So we'll do this. We'll refill the energy. Draw. Doesn't help too much. Six, seven, eight. Oh, actually, this will help. Okay. Phew! Okay. Phew! We're still not great because he can just shoot us. We've got five turns and until we just die, or less, depending on what he's got in hand. Yep. 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 Okay. That's useless now. Yep. Sure. Waste that card. I'm okay with that. Um... Do this this turn. This, the heal to this is good. Because we can win from here. What's that last card of yours? And does it help you? By the looks of things, it doesn't help you. Yeah, that makes sense. And swing at it, yep. And then that'll die, sure. So ten. And you can get precog off that is the thing. Okay. We kill you in two turns, basically. You can get precog, and then we shoot you, and you have to try and kill us. And we can draw until we have your cards. Okay, what do we draw? Let's see what we get. And then play this, do this. Can you kill us? Five damage from hand in the last two turns. Okay, that doesn't kill her. And we win. Okay. Phew. Got them. 
GG, okay, that's five wins in a row with Nassau. Like, we went first there, and so we should have won, but we fucked up, I think. Or maybe we opened bad or something, I'm not too sure. But we won there in the end. We just teetered it out. So I'm very excited about that. Alrighty, guys, thank you very much for watching. Uh, make sure you like, subscribe, follow, join, all that kind of bullshit. And um, I'll see you in the next one. So have a really good afternoon, and we'll catch you later. See you later. Bye! Oh, wow. Wow. Wow.